the reality is that in all addictions, and behavioral addictions included, there is a strong genetic component and a strong social psychological component. The research is inconclusive, but it, it, it varies from a small percentage to 50-50. If you grew up in a monastery, would you become a, a gambler? Chances are you wouldn't, even though you might have a, a biological leaning. So both environment and biology or genetics have a strong bearing on that propensity, that leaning into a, a particular ritual but that we ca are now calling a behavioral addiction.